For the boroughs, it's another typical fall weekend, even if it comes in a football season unlike any before. Last year was the toughest. I was only able to go three games. None in Baton Rouge. I can't imagine if I'd never had seen him play a game in Tiger Stadium. Go Tigers. Long before becoming Louisiana's favorite son, Joe Burrow grew up the son of a coach. I feel like football is the Burrow family, or the Burrow family is football. Football was my childhood. My youth games were on Sunday, dad's games were on Saturday, I will go to the high school games on Friday. As a player at Nebraska, the NFL, and the CFL, then as a coach at five different schools, football had been Jimmy Burrow's life for more than half a century. When you make a living, basically six years out of college playing professional football and then being a coach for all those years, making a living, I mean, that's just what we do. How would you describe your bond with him? Typical father-son relationship. I wouldn't say typical. There's a little, co there's a little coach player in there, too. Try not to be a too uh, helicopter-type dad when it came to football and coaching, but I think I helped him in that regard some. As defensive coordinator at Ohio University for the last 15 seasons, he was able to see Joe's youth, high school, and college games until his son transferred from Ohio State to LSU. I know he was upset he wasn't at the games and wasn't able to watch some of them on TV, some of the big ones. Once we hit that point and he had time to sit back and really reflect on the fact that he'd only been able to go to three games, it was time to make a hard decision for him. So Jimmy made a decision before this season to end his coaching career. The bottom line was just the opportunity to watch Joe play his senior year. I mean, I loved coaching, but just to be a part of this at LSU with Joe was, was why I retired. Ciao, ciao. Love you. It means a lot. Now that he's at every single game, you know, we can talk about what happened on the field. And he always makes sure to always ask me about my bad plays instead of my good plays. That's the old coach in him. Thank you again. All right, man. The old coach was again the dedicated father, and now the tailgating LSU fan. They said that he was gonna have a statue at LSU by oh, 2050. <laughs> you think so? Four and five hour tailgating it takes a, a while to get used to. I never sat in the stands with my family to watch another game, and it's brought our family uh, more together than, than it's ever been. Burrow out of the air again, gets rid of the pass, and time it's caught, and it's another touchdown. Justin Jefferson hits Pater. The season has been indelible, and the decision to be there for every moment, invaluable. The whole transition of Jimmy retiring has helped Joe to understand how important he is to us and how much, I mean, he's everything to us. The 2019 winner of the Heisman Memorial Trophy, Joe Burrow, Louisiana State University, congratulations. My dad, first time in 51 years that he wasn't a, a player or, or a coach, and him retiring this year has been, you know, a dream come true for me and my family. I made a good decision. It was based on family. It's made me just never, never, ever look back and, and regret it. What's up, man? Where did you come in a thing? It's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity for him. I never thought I would be here, and he's here every week watching me. I'm so excited that he's here for it.